is right now a good time to buy Jasmine or should you guys be waiting it out? Hey what's up guys welcome back to another video on the channel. Today we are going to be covering Jasmine once again. I'm going to be showing you whether or not you guys should be buying into the Jasmine project right now or whether you guys should be taking a break and waiting it out for the scenario to play out. Hey what's up guys welcome back to another video on the channel if you guys want to make massive amounts of money while trading crypto make sure you guys join the crypto cartel the link to it will be down in the description here are some of the results which we were able to achieve in my group as you can see we got a profit of 517 percent on this trade profit of 263 percent on this trade and the list goes on and on Right now, my group is costing $30 every single month. However, I think this can easily change your complete investment strategy and you guys can probably make back your money within just a matter of like one or two trades, even if you guys are starting with about $50. So if you guys want to join the crypto cartel, the link to it will be down in the description. As mentioned, it's only about $30 per month. Only limited spots are available. So make sure you guys grab more of this opportunity as soon as possible. Anyways, now right now we are shifting over to Jasmine and if we check out the charts, you can see something really really interesting playing out. Now guys, recently we saw a recent all time high for Jasmine sitting at, at a price of about 0.044. Now once we got to this price level, we saw a lot of people taking in some profits and we saw this level forming as an important resistance level for Jasmine in the shorter time frames. Now in my videos, in my past videos, I have mentioned to you all that I believe this level was not going to hold for longer periods of time because we were facing quite a bit of resistance and this was all based on a rumor which we were getting about the potential collaboration between Apple as well as Jasmine. However, since we haven't really been hearing any sorts of news regarding those collaborations, you can already see that the price momentum is not falling the price action and that is leading to the price falling towards the downside. If we calculate from the top of the range towards the bottom, you can see that the project has already dipped by about 20% which is really significant considering the move which we got beforehand as well. I guess if we open some of the indicators, let me open the MACD indicator right over here and show you what is happening. So guys, on the MACD indicator, you can see that we are slowly and slowly racking up some selling pressure, which is pretty alarming for some people, but it might be okay because we have been, uh, we haven't really got any sort of dump in quite some time. As you can see right over here, we were facing quite some resistance level. We were just moving sideways. We saw this massive pump right now. We are seeing a minor pullback and waiting for a potential move towards the upside targets as well. That said, guys, if we zoom in on the charts, I just want to show you all that right now, Jasmine is uh, at an important support level at a price level of around 0 0.033. Now, if Jasmine gets a clear uh, side towards the downside and if we see the uh, daily candle uh, opening and closing below this uh, important support level line, I believe that the price of Jasmine could potentially hit towards this price levels over here at a price of about 0 0.024. However, if Jasmine does not, uh, you know, close any candle below this support level, I do believe the price should be shifting towards the upside and this is going to be acting only as a support level for the coming weeks and then we are going to be seeing a move towards the upside. That's it guys, right now the situation is not all good. I personally believe right now Jasmine is just focusing on its growth and we are facing a minor pullback. So overall in the longer term, I'm still bullish. However, if you ask me whether I will be buying Jasmine at these price points, I would be saying yes if you guys are personally DCing into Jasmine just like I have been doing in the project. However, if you, if you guys haven't been DCing into the project and if you guys are just looking for an investment opportunity, right now is probably not a really good time to invest into the project. I mean, if you see a candle closing below the support area, uh, you know, take sh uh, any sort of short trades which are going to be really, really helpful for you all. But if you are only thinking of it as a longer uh, in the longer time frames, I think right now is a pretty good opportunity to get into the markets as I've said it previously as well. I was saying the same thing when the project was at these price points and I'm saying the same thing when the project is at, you know, these price points when the project has already done like a 10x or about 20x from those price points. If we check out the RSI indicator, you can see that we recently got a bearish crossover, which oftentimes leads to the price falling towards the downside. 
Now, even though we are seeing the price towards going towards the downside, I don't believe this move is going to be that severe as compared to some of these moves right over here, where we got no sort of buying or selling pressure more so ever. But I believe this is just a minor pullback before we see a move towards the upside. If you guys personally ask me, I am uh, the two possible scenarios for Jasmine. The positive one is going to be the price pushing towards the upside, towards the price targets of about 0.07, which is about a 110% move from the current price points. However, guys, if you think for the worst case scenario for Jasmine, I do believe there is a scenario where the product can dip towards the downside, towards these levels, at a price of about 0.024 or about a 27% drop from the current price points. So both scenarios are possible right now and whenever these kinds of situations arise in the market, it is potentially a good time to DCA for the longer time frames. However, if you guys invest into Jasmine for the shorter time frames, I think right now the situation is for, uh, is for you guys to wait it out and not be rushing into to buy Jasmine coin at these price points. Because even if you get at these price points right over here, then that will be really really helpful. One another situation which you guys can perform in order to elevate your results and in order to maximize your returns is that let's say you got $500 which you guys want to invest into Jasmine. Well, you can divide those $500 into installments of about $50 and you can start investing into Jasmine weekly of about $50. That way you would have caught price points like these and that way you would have also caught price points like these setting your overall uh, buying uh, buying quantities at you know as a good really good average and you would be st still sitting in a profit if you guys decide to hold for longer term or even if you decide to hold for shorter term this is a strategy which a lot of people like to follow It's practically called like a DCA and this is a good uh, situation to you know do that sort of scenario as well if you are focused on the longer time frames, be on the lookout guys. I think right now is a really good opportunity to get into the markets because the price has fallen from its recent all time highs. However, it's in the end all up to you. I mean, I can't make decisions on your behalf. I have given you the two scenarios for Jasmine which are going to be happening. I have given you strategies regarding how you guys should be playing out with your money. Uh, whether the project, whether you have uh, to make a long-term investment or whether you guys have to make multiple investments into Jasmine uh, in every single week. And yeah, guys, that's going to be pretty much it from this video. I hope you guys got some good insights. And if you did, make sure you guys drop a like on this video. Subscribe to my channel if you are new. And as always, I'll catch you all tomorrow with another one. Hope you all have an amazing day ahead. Peace out.